Hello everybody and welcome to The Witch's House, an RPG Maker Horror Game. Which I'm going to be playing. Let's begin. Bugs have taken up residence in this rotten log. Blank's house out of the forest. Towering lush tree. You're up and at him, eh? Patch of spiky grass. And with a tree. As a maker of RPG Maker games, I will say these are amazing effects for using default tile sets. Way is blocked by a startlingly huge patch of roses. That's not normal. That's not normal. Hmm? I don't mind if you go out to play, but just stay away from the forest. Hope to see you home soon. Well, I already broke that little arrangement. Eco-terrorism! <laughs> the way is cleared. Shetty broke! Isn't that convenient? Can't go John Claude Van Damme on these people. Oh, oops, I accidentally walked in. No! Oh, thank goodness. Cat's still out here. Back so soon? I don't think you need my help. Darn it, I skipped a funny scene. Thanks, cat. Hmm. Suspicious. I'm sure it's fine. I was turned into strawberry jam. By walls. Come to my room. Is this still crap? The answer is yes! I'm a winner on Jeopardy! Da -da -da. This is pretty. Vase of roses. Candle slay, sway, flame sway curiously. Yo! Decided I'd follow you for laughs. Suddenly, where the heck you'd come out from? Let me out of here. Hmm? It won't open. There's scissors on the workbench. They're chained to the bench, stupid. Hmm, a dusty old dredger, there's nothing inside. Locked. Bear has. That, that, that's bear? The basket has a big teddy bear in it. There's a little bit of room left. Bear's in the basket. Large shot clock, time marches on. Which is diary. I was six, so no one played with me. My father and mother didn't love me. That seems like an assumption. It says open when the house returns to normal. Teddy bear rests against a pile of presents. This seems stupid, but not a teddy bear. What are you made of lead? Hmm. Mmm. Take that. Alright, they're chained to the bench. Cut off the bear's limbs? Sure. This doesn't seem bad. Cut off the teddy bear's limbs. Cut teddy bear torso. And it was filled with ketchup. Yeah, you never want your teddy bears being filled with ketchup. You just decrease the property value, man. I will have to clean that up. Handled her out. Hmm. That's not sus at all. Yeah, put that back. So it's a teddy bear torso in the blanket. Or basket. Heard an unlocking sound somewhere. Wait a minute. What do you say? Oh, it moved. 
Did you also change the flooring? I didn't pay for that. Dagnabbit, stop ruining my stuff. You know how much that goes for on for maybe? Oh, hi there. Bye there. Now where was I? All oh, right, door. Teddy bear limbs on the ground. Never know when you need a hand. Uh, okay, opening the door. Taste poison. I'm gonna save real quick. And... Push this out of the way. Lingering colored soup in a skull shaped bowl. Sure, I'll drink it. Really? Yeah. Viola was poisoned. Heard an unlocking sound somewhere. Medic. Someone invisible there. I'm busy, so busy. Lend a hand. Oh, thank you. A invisible person grabs your arm. Push your wrist on the cutting board. A hand is exactly what I needed. At least let me taste the soup. Okay. I get you. You want me to use the teddy bear limb to give him a hand because they're naturally delicious made of stuffing. Thank you, I was in need of a hand or two. Let me show my appreciation. Silver key. Alright, there was something on the table. Dining of aristocrats. People of ruling wealthy classes and long to enjoy dining with silverware. Using such hard to clean cutlery, they could hire servants to demonstrate their wealth. In addition, silver utensils could change color upon contact with poison, making them quite useful. Too bad we use aluminum. Did I just step in a rat? Pretty sure I just said all right. Oh well. <laughs> Makes a pleasant sound. Let's put the key in the soup. Key turned black in the soup. Locking sound somewhere. A fireplace. Sure. Nothing but soot. Hmm. It's cat back there. Cat. Cat. Darn you, 1958 vintage wine. Take that, and that. Hmm, he's gone, and the book is closed. They wear glasses, seasoning, there's nothing particularly eye catching. Door open. I definitely did squish a rat. Whoops. Hey, little girl. You wanna play? Where did you go? Decorative cat ornament. Gotcha. Ornament figure with a spear. Feels like it could move at any moment. What's in here, though? This suspicious black door with no paint. Barrel, barrel. There's a rope in the barrel. Sure. Spider has four eyes. Can't even tell colors apart. It won't open. Oh no, the spider knows how to lock doors. And also. Can't distinguish butterfly from human head. Hmm. At least we got the rope, though. Got rope! We thought it moved slightly, but it must be your imagination, just like any other horror, horror pro tag.
Ah, you're giving me this? Thank you. Take this. Thanks. Thanks a lot. The Book of Death is exactly what I needed. Witch's house. Keys do not open doors in a witch's house. Something else must serve as a key. Form of the house can be changed by way of the witch's magic. Residence burns down. Family was found dead in the wreckage. Their bodies have stab wounds, so it's expected they were murdered before the building was set aflame. No way, Dollar Ireland, currently seven, has been missing since the fire. The police. Ugly. Funny story. It's upon a time there was a rich man pulling a long cart full of treasure. His guard had broken down in the woods, but there came a passive hunter and his dog. The rich man pleaded the hunter to keep a close eye on his cart, to which the hunter agreed. The rich man went to get a new cart, meanwhile the hunter kept watch. That soon fell and the hunger hunter grew worried for worried for his elderly mother still at home. So the hunter told the dog to watch the cart and went home to check his mother. The man returned, he saw the dog on guard. So he gave the dog a reward for his master, a silver coin to carry in his mouth. The dog ran all the way home and brought the master the coin. The hunter flew into a rage. Told you to watch the cart, and what did you do? You stole from it. So the hunter killed the dog. Which of the waste over here? Friggin' mocking statues. Hmm. Contains a human head. So, what does the Book of Death do? You sure. It does typical Book of Death things. Yeah, yeah. A bookshelf. I mean, oh, guess would this be put on the shelf? Yep. No, oh, little little glass ca case coming off. That kind of sounds like a glass case. And also my skull getting crushed in by another skull. Skull Shepkin! Hmm. Yada 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 yada. Ouch. My back and face. Probably in that order. They really don't give you very much time for that. The door will save me! And apparently it's gone. Nothing in it. Take the butterfly! And get out of here. Good luck with your indigestion, spider, when you eat that model. The butterfly flutters out of your hands and slips through the wall. Locking sound somewhere. Lag is low on the wall. Door is open. I've got strawberry jam on the carpet. And strawberry jam on the books. Brigand don't know property value and things I have to clean. 
Sandbags, for some reason. Yo! Oh, the red stain is sticky. Either ketchup packets or friggin' tomato jam. Or jam, in general. Ouch. 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 And there we go. Yo! By the way, this is a witch's house. You knew that, right? Right. Right. Right, 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 right. A sack. You can see small tear in it. Oh, with dead cats. You dead? Is that it? You like frogs? Sure. Oh, do you like frogs? Well, that was preemptive. Um... A very thin bridge. Let me save first. You never know with these things. Send the frog! Heard an unlocking sound somewhere. I shall name you... Kermit. Or Hermit because of copyright. Um, this seems to be a symmetry puzzle. Let's see what? What do you have me do? Push this plant. Cake here. That shouldn't be there. Um, frog. I believe that's right. Is that right? Unlocking sound. Gonna save. Never know. My brother didn't love me, so I X them. I've been in this house ever since. Through the next door, let nothing distract you! He's hungry. Something's on the other side. Sure, why not? Snake. Like big growling, says a palm. Or let's send the frog in. Force it in. Mm. 
Ketchup packets everywhere. No, oh, hi, frog. Not sure what this is supposed to be, but okay. You looking at me? I think the head moved. Of course it moved. Cat statue. Kidding! Hey, don't ignore me! Man, you were seriously rocking out at that time. Can't even talk to it. I think that moved. Now, if a statue's head moved in that velocity, go where only one eye is open. Trick question. Found a passage. Make sound in four rooms. Yo, this floor's pretty quiet. But I think that'll be all for this episode. On the next episode of Witch's House, we'll be continuing through the house. See you guys then.